Well, hello and welcome to what amounts to football heaven. It doesn't get a whole lot better than this. The conditions are utopian. The sky is blue, players are with us for a football match so widely and keenly anticipated. Truly, this is pristine, and the uh, level of expectation and excitement is reflected in the smiling faces of the crowd. They know it means so much, and they also experience between them a great sense of privilege at uh, being able to attend this most special of games. Certainly, this is a very, very impressive venue, quite a sight to behold. According to what we've been told, this is how it looks. It's 4-3-3. Uh, yes, and the importance of this formation is not to allow the midfield three and the attacking three to become too detached from one another. If that happens, then pressure can quickly be applied via the counter-attack and you can be exposed defensively. So compactness can't be compromised. And you need talkers in this team. You need leaders and people that are willing to organise things very quickly. Got on the way here pretty promptly. Pleguezuelo. Pleguezuelo plays it forward. Well, that's where he wants it. That looks a foul. Yep, referee's given it. Well, the ref's been lenient here. I doubt he'll get too many more chances. He's having a go. Out to the right. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. The referee's awarded a free kick. There could be trouble here. But for now, the referee is keeping his cards in his pocket. Repelled by the keeper. Good defending, albeit from an unexpected source. Well, they say that your front lads should be that first line of, um, of stopping the opposition. And I think he's taken it to another level with his desire to get back and, and help everyone out. And he nearly went all the way. I just hope he won't let the failure to score affect him. With the ability he has, he can reproduce. Towering header! And that's caused a worry or two. That's a little unfortunate. He had a lot of people worried then. No change to the score, nil-nil it remains. Forward it goes. With a delicate ball. 
Uh, ball needed to be better there, that's a wasted chance. Defence has got rid of that. Played out to the right. Oh, that had to be more accurate. Hoists it forward. Degethuelo. Oriol Busquets. Tries to get it forward quickly. Chip through. Cleared away. And it's played forward. Plays it out to the flank. Going through. And he's got the ball glued to his feet. Going for goal! Turns and goes back. Cross deflected over the goal line for a corner. Played it short. That's not going far. Back in once more. Massive leap! Goal! It is a good finish. The odds were against him. Little matter. Oh, this fella's as slippery as a needle the way he freed himself to score. I mean, for that defence, it was a case of now you've got him, now you don't. Brilliant. Deadlock broken, it's 1-0. Well, just listen to the reaction, I think you can hear the approval from the support all around the stadium. Lobs it in gently. Keeper's ball. <laughs> the defence can get it clear. The first half is done, so there you have it, a close sport half of football, but one that still had its moments, but ultimately produced just one goal. A more than decent game up to now. Well, it hasn't exactly got the plan so far, but there's no need to panic, there's still plenty of time to get back into this. As always, an early goal would help swing things back in their favour. Here we go again, then. Twenty don't need to press the panic button just yet. They may have to tweak their, their setup first if they don't grab an early goal in the second half. They can't hold back, though. Good clearance and very necessary. Dashing forward at pace. Great leap! <laughs> no, he couldn't get the direction he needed. I have to commend the wing plate, but I have to condemn the defending. They've got to stop the cross.
Tries to get it forward quickly. Back into the middle. Plays it out to the wing. Lovely bit of skill there. Oh, the defence got the better of him this time, but I'm sure he'll go again. Goes long. Nicely worked. And he's there to cut it out. Well, it's good stuff. This is better. Jim, there's not too much subtlety or sophistication about this. It really is a question of needs must. Well, there's no two ways about it. This is what they have to do. Oriol Busquets. So, Jim, what are you thinking? Well, the time has arrived to start taking risks. They may well be happy just to level this. And that's been lever clear. Oh, well defended. That had to be done. Forward it goes. He's making good use of his strength there, just refuses to be out-muscled. Out to the left it goes. Lovely feet. Looking for a decent ball in. Twenty are definitely not going down without a scrap. Their attitude just can't be faulted. Oriol Busquets. Well, if something's going to happen, it's going to have to happen now. All they need is one big chance, and it may do the trick. Played into the middle. Russia stays on, it is a corner. So now we're going to get those changes we have been expecting. Tries to get it clear. Twente have to get it into the box and quickly. Pings it out wide. Gets into some space. Up to meet it! Just couldn't turn it in. No, that was a slick move, and there were several options in the box to, uh, to pick out. Great run, this. He's covered quite a distance. That's a look and place. Gets up to head it! Good delivery. No joy. Twente can defend those situations better by stopping the crosser at source. So that's it, it is all over. One goal settled it, a tense and exciting game that just got away. How would you summarise what we've seen today then, Jim? That's a fairly demoralising loss, they hardly threatened.